once the patient arrives, uh, he or she will uh, be um, uh, transported onto the table, which is here. Um, and uh, these are the pieces of equipment that uh, we have to allow us to see and do what, what we need to to relieve that blockage. This first piece of equipment, once we have the patient sedated, um, this is called a radial sheath, where it's a small tube that ends up going inside the radial artery. Um, and this is where we can pass all of our equipment to get up to the heart and do what we need to do. So this is piece of equipment number one. Once uh, that sheath is in, this is what a coronary catheter looks like. And again, this will end up traveling up the entire arm and essentially will go around the shoulder and kind of lodge uh, right where the arteries begin uh, to feed the heart with blood. We will end up injecting dye through um, these catheters and we can see uh, exactly where the blockage or blockages occur. The way we see them is actually not looking through the catheter directly, but we can actually see it on this big screen that's sitting in, in front of me. Because what we're doing is we're uh, taking video x-ray images of that dye as it fills the inside of the, the blood vessels. And uh, this piece of equipment here is the x-ray uh, tubing and the um, uh, how we get our images. And we can take a bunch of different pictures uh, by maneuvering this camera, you know, left, right, we take a bunch of different uh, pictures um, to see exactly what's going on um, during the case. And again, the patient's here, and I'm doing what I need to do, watching everything on the screen. Once we figure out uh, where the blockage is, uh, we want to treat it immediately. And the way that we do that is we pass uh, an undeployed stent through. On the left, you'll see uh, what it looks like before we implant it into the blocked artery. Uh, it is a, a metal device that is on an uninflated balloon platform. And once we get it to the position that we want it to be, uh, we inflate a balloon inside the stent to expand it into a cylinder. And once we take the balloon out after it's been inflated, on the right, you'll see what the stent looks like uh, after it's been deployed. This uh, device is one of our balloon inflators and uh, basically this gets hooked onto the end of the stent uh, balloon and we are able to essentially twist this and inflate the balloon to whatever pressure we would like and that's how we expand the stents and place them into the blocked artery to relieve that obstruction.